Hey everybody, welcome back to episode of Let's Play a Demo. Of course, my name is Xene Shadow, and welcome to Ben 10 Alien Force Rise of Hex. I I'm not joking about this one. Now, I usually don't play these kind of games, but I don't have that many types of games as these demos. And I actually had this demo locked away in my Xbox 360 for the longest time next to like a bunch of Sonic games and some other stuff, so... That's why we're playing it. And I gotta say, as a kid growing up, um, I did watch the all the original episodes of the original Ben 10. Just straight up Ben 10, when he was still like 10 years old or something. Um, that was way better. Yeah, maybe the episodes got boring afterwards. But then the new episodes actually had replay volume, as I've seen. But, replay volume. Replay value, but... In a way, I don't know. The, the, the franchise has something I do like about, but not something that, like, okay, the story's not too much I want to remember other than, like, this happens to that and that, and then, like, a bunch of aliens. You're not even going to remember their names. Uh, if they say, like, once or twice and then never say it again. Uh, and then that's really it. So, yeah. Now, this demo, it's, well, decent, actually. It's decent. Um, it's not bad nor good. It's second like okay. That's that's what it is. It's an okay. Um, I gotta say, I, I was expecting more things for this game, even including it's a Ben 10 game. Just because, not saying Ben 10 games are bad, it's that they're okay. The very first Ben 10 game I actually played was the very first one ever. The actual release was Ben 10 Protector of Earth, and that was way better than this game. And you'll see why. So I'm not going to read that, just read it for yourselves. Uh, also, uh, this game is supposed to be around when Charmcaster is still with his her uncle Hex, which they're like spellcasters, if you haven't really told. From the Charmcaster, and whatever, Hex, and whatever. Alright, so that's Ben 10, of course, and blah blah blah, Omnichake's going to alien up, that's his cousin, Gwen, and I preferred her as a child, for some reason. Now, this is just terrible. I don't even care what Ben 10's been saying. Just look at this fucking thing. This is something I see Cartoon Network doing, and yes, it is Cartoon Network, so not too much I guess I can expect from there, but the Ben 10 Protector of Earth thing, that was way better. I'm serious, that was way fucking better. Go play that game. Uh, also, um, yeah, just look at the stupid... Just look how Ben looks. He just looks too fucking flat. Like, his arms are barely even there. It's like, I don't know, just problems. Anyways. Now this whole demo, you're only gonna be picking two aliens. We got Swampfire and Brainstorm. Sorry, I almost forgot his name. Now the other ones, I can tell you what they are if I remember them. So the one next to Brainstorm, he is. I'm just gonna have to look around for a second. Okay, he's Big Chill. The one below that is Spider Monkey. The one beside that is Echo Echo. The one under that is Lone Star. The one next to that is chromostone uh next to that is uh jet ray next to that is cannon bolt and the well i think it's cannon bolt can't really tell and the next one after that is uh goop i'm not joking about these names so anyways uh i gotta pick a swamp fire all right now, in this game, I gotta say, they actually did fix one thing I did have a problem with the original game, which I played back in the day. You can switch to alien, any aliens you want to just right away, without getting Pacific Power Up later on in the first game, so... I gotta say that. That's pretty good. But this 2D, like, aspect ratio, it's not great. It's not great. I preferred the first game better. Yeah, maybe some of the aliens are not fused like, like this game is. Like, oh, Swamp Fire is a fuse of, um... What was it? Uh... Damn it, do I got their names? Uh, Wild Vine and Heat Blast. There you go. But, as you can see, Swamp Fire, Wild Vine is a vine like thing, which is just for plants. And Heat Blast, she was a volcano like thing. And stuff, so. Anyways, the music, I gotta say, for this demo alone, they should have picked a better music. I don't know if it's just for the level itself, or they should pick a better level, or maybe it's the easiest level in the game. I don't know. Maybe that's why I don't, I don't have that many aliens, because it might be 
but he hasn't locked them yet, even though it's a bit odd, but hey, I, I don't know. I don't even, I don't, I'm not even planning to get this. I, I, I'm not, it's just not that good. I honestly, I think I could play better ones than these, especially the first Ben 10, and I did beat the first Ben 10 with my friend Justin, and no, I can't tell you his name because other than his name is Justin. Uh, he doesn't have like a gamer name or anything other than his name is just Justin. Now, I'm pretty sure he had names back then, but nothing that I really stuck with back then. So, anyways, this is Brainstorm, if I haven't really said. He's this crab thing that, uh, that's a crab thing. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Um, also, if you lose power of your Omni Tricks, that's what the little watch that pops up is like this. That's why it looks like a watch, sort of. Or if not, I don't know. Um, Omnitrix has like a billion aliens inside, except he only can pick a selected few, which is unlocked, which is, think of it as a video game, when you do Pacific things or heroic things or you transform into a Pacific alien way too many times, you might accidentally, yeah, I'm serious, might accidentally get a new alien other than maybe scanning it. Yeah, I'm not joking. So think of it as a video game kind of thing. Okay. Now, uh, okay, I didn't tell you what uh, Brainstorm was fused with. Brainstorm... Uh, yeah, Brainstorm. Um, you know, I don't remember right now. I can't. Uh, that, that, uh, are you serious? I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. I'll tell you something in a second. That you're going to like be like, oh, wow, Shadow, you couldn't do this. You, you understand why in a second. Stop doing that. Okay. Alright, Brainstorm... I know he has the intellect of one of the past aliens in the original Ben 10, and then I don't know from the electrics, I don't remember. Uh, anyways. Yeah, okay, see, that's why that happened. Now, it takes a while to do. Like, it, I, have to, I have to glitch it a little just for me to even get up there. See? And there's no double jump feature. You just have to keep on jumping until it actually allows you to. That's what I like. That's why it's surprising the first time I did that. So, see, I'm not even gonna do it again. But, that's just surprisingly. And that took me, like, a long time to fucking do it. So. And that alone, just kind of like, oh, this game had a, so much to improve on, kind of thing. So, yeah. Also, oh, fuck. Oh, oh, okay. Actually, perfect timing. No, you know what? Just switch. Just switch. Brainstorm. Brainstorm. Attacks both of them. Okay, okay, okay. I know you're pretty hurt, Ben. No, 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 no. Brainstorm. Okay. Alright. Good, good, good job. Now back to Swamp Fire. Okay, now I'm just doing it on... I don't know. Like, I guess I just sucked the first time. Right, right, right. Okay. I need... I need the key. Uh, okay. Now... Why did I fall? Hmm. You know, it's just so odd. Ah, oh, there it is. I was like, I'm expecting an elevator. Now... Come over here. It's just this game would have been much better. It really would have. If it wasn't with this 2D, like, aspect ratio. I feel bad for just playing old Ben Tennyson. It's because he can be beat up with anything, but he still fights in this game. And it takes longer. See? Oh, and you can't jump that far with Ben. I can fall right here. Yeah. Alright, just get that medallion looking thing. And it opens that up. Alright. And now, let's fight. Oh yeah, if I didn't mention what Ben Ben's name is, or his last name is, you know how the show's called Ben 10? What's his last name? You're probably saying, oh, <laughs> that's stupid, it's 10. S sort of. It's Ben 10 a sin. Yeah. Ben Tennyson. And his rival, Kevin 11. And no, it's not like Kevin 11 sin, it's just Kevin 11. Or his friend in his... Whatever. Okay. Yeah, um, yeah, and that's it.
that I think that's the rest of the, I think that's the, that's eight of the demo. I'm pretty sure that's probably it. So there you go. That's Ben 10 Alien Force: The Rise of Hex. Now I know for a fact this is old because I know there's oh there's Ben 10 Omniverse and Ben 10 the Ultimate Alien, whatever all that stuff is. But that's Ben 10 Rise of Hex in a nutshell. Kitties. So, yeah. As always, my name is Being Seen Shadow. Like the video, subscribe, leave a comment, any comments below, and I'll see you guys for the next one, right? And for sure, and for a fact, it will not be Let's Playing demo of a Ben 10 thing. Anyways, I'll see you guys for the next one. Bye.